Hey guys, Andrew Denko here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, making a video on my favorite pair of boots, arguably the best pair of boots in the Marine Corps. These are the Danner Reckonings. So why do I say that they are the um, best pair or you know the uh, the top pair of, uh, of boots in the Marine Corps? Well, the reason is because ultimately they're super light and they're very, uh, they allow your, your foot as a whole to, uh, to both breathe and also move pretty, uh, pretty freely, which is pretty uncommon to find in a boot, especially like if, you, if you're somebody who's already uh, tested out or has worn before Marine Corps issued boots, they're pretty sturdy, pretty, um, pretty heavy. And that's of course for you know, the support of your ankle um, you know, and just the foot as a whole, which I can certainly respect. Um, but when we're doing things like trail running, when we're doing things like the O course, the combat fitness test, we obviously want something a little bit lighter so we have more flexibility and more um, ability as a whole to run those as fast as we can get the best possible times. And I think there is no better way than picking up a pair of the Danner Reckoning shoes. Now, I got uh, these actually um, before I went to Officer Candidate School. So for those of you guys who are interested in going to Officer Candidate School, you can bring a pair of boots with you. You will get issued two additional pairs. Uh, but I would recommend you bring a pair that you are able to break in. So make sure you wear them a couple times. Like I said, run in them, ruck in them, do whatever you need to do in the boots and that so that you're bringing a pair that is already broken in. Um, but like I said, I brought a pair of the Danner Reckonings and I can't tell you how much of a lifesaver they truly were. They were, like I said, very light, very easy to use when I ran, you know, different events in which I wanted to have uh, the lightest and, you know, uh, the, I, the the least amount of weight, but the lightest boots. Um, these were kind of these were my go-to. And anytime I did a graded event, and like I said, graded events, um, you know, back in some of my other videos, graded events are pretty common at OCS. Namely, with the physical um, standpoint, you'll do them pretty frequently. So for your physical grade, you will, like I said, for the CFT, for the O course, and for the um, the E course. So the obstacle course and the endurance course. Um, you will be using and you will be wearing boots. So you wanna make sure that they are as light as possible. Now, uh, this, like I said, this is a you know very light and easy uh, you know option. It is uh, within Marine Corps regulations. So you can obviously wear this in uniform. You guys can see that there, but the uh, EGA is printed there. Uh, within the regulations, these are both in regulation for the uh, boot style itself, as well as the color. Um, so again, like I said, look into getting a pair of these. Um, alternatively, I believe there's another uh, another brand. It's, it's Bates. I think they're called Bates Lights. I don't really know much about them, but that's like just a secondary option if you guys aren't um, going to get a pair of these. But I would recommend, like I said, the Danner Reckonings. One thing I will mention is that they are pretty dang expensive. So try to buy them used if you can. So I think retail, they're like 200 and seventy dollars or something like that which is kind of outrageous for a pair of boots um worth it but pretty outrageous so what i'd recommend is going on ebay and picking up a used pair that's what i did um it was a lot cheaper and honestly the guy who i bought them from only wore them like once he said the size was off and he just got a new pair so you can usually find good deals i only paid maybe 160 bucks for them um you know and even if you buy a used pair that's a little bit tattered that's quite all right too if you want to use them for training um, obviously just, you know, goes without saying, don't be wearing a tattered pair of boots in uniform. Uh, appearance is number one, whether you're going to officer candidate school or you're in the fleet. Um, you know, obviously we want to look the part whenever we are in the core. So, um, so like I said, just take that into account, but nonetheless, uh, that's pretty much everything I have for this video. Just wanted to introduce these, my favorite pair of boots. I think the best pair of boots in the Marine Corps. Um, if you guys have any questions on these or any questions on what type of training you should be doing in boots. Uh, before you go to say officer candidate school or even um, you know boot camp, let me know in the comment section below and we'll go from there. Hit it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and drop a comment below.